I'm Betsy Bay Ramos and this is your UWW-TV news update. The solar eclipse that traveled across North America on April 8th was a memorable experience for all and Whitewater joined in on the fun. Although we did not see the maximum reach of totality, the community of Whitewater got together at Whitewater Observatory located behind Higher Hall to view the spectacle. The eclipse began at 12.51 in the afternoon and reached its maximum at 2.06 and ended by 3.20 in the afternoon. Eclipse glasses and telescopes equipped with solar filters were set up outside the observatory. Chancellor King sent a campus-wide email regarding university financial assessments on Thursday, April 11th. The email stated how the universities of Wisconsin have been working with a third-party consultant to conduct financial assessments of each campus and that UW-Whitewater was the first to volunteer. The goal of this project is to provide data and context for universities to address budget deficits. Chancellor Corey A. King went on to explain the data that was publicly released and ways of highlighting the major areas of improvement within established strategies that are known campus-wide. If you'd like to read the full report, check your inbox for the announcement. April is Sexual Assault Awareness Month and University Health and Counseling Services are collecting old shoes through April 22nd for a sole survivor display. The artwork will be displayed outside of the Ambrose Health Center on April 24th and is intended to show that sexual assault occurs among all communities on campus and around the world. If you have any old or unused shoes, please consider donating. After the exhibit is over, all shoes will be donated to the Community Space, a local source for free houseware items. And we'll have more updates after a quick break. <laughs> The 2024 Universities of Wisconsin Board of Regents Teaching Excellence Award has been received by UW-Whitewater's Department of Special Education. The award is made to an academic department, program, or other academic unit that demonstrates exceptional commitment to and effectiveness in teaching. The special education program is unique in the state with its mission to prepare professionals to become change agents in their support of individuals with disabilities and their families. A big congratulations goes out to the department. Registration for the fall 2024 semester has been open for the past two weeks, but registration for summer classes has also begun. The advantages of taking courses over the summer months include keeping the momentum up to graduate on time, freeing up your fall schedule, and taking up to 12 credits, which is almost a full semester. Most classes are three or six weeks and most are fully online. If you have any questions regarding summer classes, contact your academic advisor. For more updates, check us out at uwwtv.org. I'm Betsy Bay Ramos, and this has been your news update on UWW-TV.